Volunteer crews in Rio Rancho are working as fast as they can to finish a new park so everyone can enjoy the facilities, including people with special needs. It is located near Westside Boulevard in Unser, but as KOHT Action 7 News reporter Kristen Swanson found out, some construction is on hold because of a big problem. She is live with this story tonight. Kristen. Yeah, Royal, you can see this whole area has really transformed over the last couple of months. A lot of the playground equipment is in place, but you can also see there's still a lot to do. The nonprofit behind this project says they need a lot more money to do it. From the outside, it looks like any other city park with slides, swings, and other playground equipment. But Jenny Schulte Riedel says these six acres in Rio Rancho are unique. This park is like none other in the entire state. It's called a park above. The equipment is specifically designed for children with special needs. For example, this special swing set. It allows someone in a wheelchair to stay in their chair and swing right alongside other kids who use normal swings. There are lots and lots of children that are missing outdoor activities because there's no place for them to go. Earl Wade is with the Rotary Club of Rio Rancho. He says Schulte Riedel came up with the idea when she joined the group. The club helped create the nonprofit organization that collects donations and recruits volunteers. A lot of the work done out here is done for free by the different uh, businesses. Which is why it's taking so long to finish the park. We've been relying on uh, donations, a lot of donations. But those donations are falling short. The group needs close to half a million dollars to complete the project. But Schulte Riedel isn't discouraged by the number, and she says she'll find a way to get the project done. Now, the park is a city of Rio Rancho park approved by the governing body. Both the city and the county actually kicked money into this project when it first started, but the nonprofit says they're relying on private donations right now to finish up a lot of this work. Live in Rio Rancho, Kirsten Swanson, KOAT Action 7 News.